it's springtime. We put the snowmobile away and we got the bikes out. Gonna go see if we can still jump bikes. Hopefully not wreck on the first day of the season. Came over here to Pocatello. The snow is finally melted down low. It's still pretty snowy up on the mountaintops as you can see. So staying low, finding some jumps and let's get into it. We'll probably start on this one. This is a good step up that we start on every year. So we'll go from here. I'm nervous. First jumps of the season. So we're gonna go down, hit a little jump there, another step down into a step up. But I am a little nervous, it's a good feeling. Here we go. And worst case, if you short it, like with how much travel you got on your bike, yeah. it's not too bad. I was pretty nervous. My hands were shaking, but it felt great to get back in the air. Uh, Taylor's gonna go ahead and attempt this step up for his first time. He's never been here before. And he actually got into riding just last year. I kind of convinced him to buy a bike. He's my brother-in-law, forced him into it. But we've had him up the Teton Pass and he's doing awesome, so. Let's see if he can go ahead and clear this first try. If he does, I'd be amazed. Nice. Shorted it, but that's super common on that one. Nice, dude. I'll take that for the first Yeah, I mean, every person that jumps that the first time, I'm pretty sure that's exactly how it goes. Is just kind of short it on the back tire. It's not that rough since it's a step up. Well, it doesn't flow as good too if you don't hit those first few jumps. Yeah, the drop jump into it really sets you up good. Go try it again. He shorted it just a little bit on the first one. See how the second one goes. Still a little bit short. More speed! That's the blessing of having 170 mils travel right there. Just eats it up. Yeah. Rocking the hard tail up here. True man right there. <laughs> I don't know about that. All right, attempt number three for Taylor with the step up. More speed. There it is. Butter. Isn't that crazy? First, basically still his first year biking. Did three attempts, <laughs> cleared it like butter. Yeah, that's fun. That was awesome. Well, let's uh, keep heading up. All right. So this is the last one of this little three pack. I think it's three. Come up and over that hill. And these landings, you can tell they haven't had much work yet. I'll rut it out from the runoff. So this is the biggest gap of this three pack, but definitely doable. And then there's one more up top. What do you think, Taylor? I mean, it'd be nice if I had some warm up. <laughs> this is the warm up. <laughs> 16, making me look bad. So we're climbing to the top. To the I've never the actually climbed this high over here to see what's up here. We usually just stick to the bottom where the big jumps are. Just trying to get ready for Jackson when it opens up. But honestly, Jackson won't be open for another month and a half. There's still so much snow in the mountains, so probably gonna get to know these trails pretty good this year. But why am I climbing to the top? Whew. Legs are burning. Oh yeah, exploring Pocatello's finest outdoors right here. An average trail for an average guy. 
Are these jumps? We got some jumps. Oh yeah. Trying to keep up with Ryan and his hardtail. Going uphill, that's not gonna be easy. If that's all the climbing you have to do to get to the jumps, wouldn't be bad to actually shuttle this clear to the bottom. Yeah, I wish I would have had a bike that would handle this as I was growing up. Probably would have gotten me a lot better biking than I am. It's getting darker up here in the canyon. There's a lot of kids up here actually. Like four or five cars in the parking lot and at least probably ten riders. So pretty busy day for the Pocatello jumps. Got Taylor down here. I'm going to go hit a couple new jumps for the day. A little hit down here. It's the first time I've ever hit this jump right here. But it slowed me into the three pack really good. It's like a tiny gap, it's just a really steep takeoff, but that was fun. I don't even know if any of this footage, like my GoPro angle or any of it, I haven't looked at it to see if it's gonna work. <laughs> 